major milestone for China's space ambitions tonight, launching its first lunar probe. Now, officials say it's going to release a six wheeled lunar rover equipped with four cameras and two mechanical legs. Now, a public vote determined the name of the lunar rover. Who said it's not a democracy? They're calling it U2, which means Jade Rabbit. China's space program is trying to take on America and win. David McKenzie is out front from Be Beijing tonight, this morning, obviously, David, for you. Well, what are you hearing about this mission? Well, it is a pretty secretive mission and definitely very significant, Erin, that they're launching their first lunar probe. They're going to put this buggy on the ground on the surface of the moon, they hope, sometime in December. The Jade Rabbit will do some investigations on the, the lunar surface, and certainly it's a big deal for China in terms of pride and the latest move in a very accelerating space race. Erin? And, and, and David, what can you tell us about whether the space program is a threat to the United States? I mean, this is obviously coming on a day where we're reporting uh, they're putting an aircraft carrier to confront the U.S. because the U.S. Uh, flew some B-52 bombers over what China believes to be its territory. Well, in 10 short years, China has gone from putting the first astronaut out into space uh, to this step, and they hope to put a space station and even put an astronaut on the moon by the end of the decade. They're certainly taking this very seriously. It's a point of national pride here in China. The Chinese say it's nothing to do with any uh, conflict, that this is a peaceful process. They want to share their technology. Uh, but the U.S. Defense Department has repeatedly said that they need to watch the Chinese space program very closely, Aaron, and they do believe that China is looking to flex its muscles on the world stage and also, of course, in outer space.